Let us go to Tom in the Bronx on the great WABC. Go. Glad you took my call. I'd like to say that low-level socialism yes, yes. can work and does. Yes, yes. Uh, the, uh, like, um, Henry yes. Ford practiced that. Yes. In other words, where he treated the help decent and they... That's can't. not socialism, sir. The that is. Socialism. Owning of the means of production is socialism, sir. It's a, it's a socialistic... No, 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 listen yeah. to me, listen to me, sir. It's not a socialistic anything. That is a capitalist deciding that he wanted to keep his workers and treat them well so they wouldn't leave the assembly line. It's nothing to do with socialism. The government wasn't involved at all, Tommy. Uh, no, but it was low-level socialism. And no, it's not other... low-level socialism. Well, it's capitalism. It but why would you call it that when it has nothing to do with socialism? Because he cared about his health. Listen to me. I care about the people that work with me. A lot of capitalists care about the people who work with them. Don't tell me socialists care about people when socialists care about abstractions and big government and redistributing wealth and social engineers and don't treat human beings as human beings. Henry Ford was not a socialist. And the fact that he gave those benefits to his assembly line workers had nothing to do with government or socialism. Now, you can keep walking around your house today calling it low-grade socialism all you want, but it's not. Well, I call it that. I know you do. Congratulations. I'll see you later. You can call it a kumquat if you want. That's not what socialism is. It's low-grade socialism, ladies and gentlemen. It shows that you care about people. Really? Well, they have low-grade or is it high-grade socialism in Britain? Anybody been there lately? Anybody been there since they've had socialism? The people seem happy with their health care? How about their dentists? Have you noticed? They don't smile a lot, the folks there. No offense, because they can't see their dentist. Why? Their teeth are yellow. Many of them are missing teeth. Really? Yes, really. Do you know we're short almost a million doctors in this country? Market watch. Oh, yeah. Doctors disappearing in America. That's the headline. Primary care shortage is growing especially acute in rural areas. By the way, I don't think they have a lot of sidewalks in rural areas either. Do they, Mr. Producer? By most projections, it's going to get a lot worse, they report. The U.S. could lose as many as one million doctors by 2025. Hey, that's low-grade socialism. Hey, baby, we really care about the people. Ah, bullcrap.